Hello friends, good day. Welcome to our YouTube channel GKR Soft. In this video, we are going to discuss the difference between little endian and big endian. You can consider you have a variable or data and you want to store the particular data inside the computer memory. So once you are trying to store the data inside the computer memory, but how the computer is going to follow the order to understand all those things, NDNS is the matter. First, we can see what is NDNS. NDNS refers the order of the bytes. There are two main types of NDNS. One is little endian, another one is big endian. Little endian means it follow post byte order. In big endian, it's called as network byte order. In little endian, LSB byte store first means at lower address. In big endian, MSB byte store first means at lower address. But the complete NDNS of a computer system, it's determined by its architecture. Most common computers are little endian, while mainframe computers are typically a big endian. How the data stored in little endian and big endian machines? You can consider or you can take an example. You have a 32-bit processor and need to store a value inside the memory. So here, I have taken example of 4-byte data. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The 1, 2 is MSB, 7, 8 is LSB. You can consider the particular variable or data. If I want to store inside the big Indian machine, then the address order will follow like the lower address will hold the MSB. As we discussed in this slide, the same way in the next address, you will have the another subsequent characters or bytes. And 0, 2 has 5, 6, 0, 3 has 7, 8. But same way, if you want to store inside the little Indian machine, then here in the lower address, your LSB byte will get stored. Then it will follow the subsequent orders. So this is the way big Indian and little Indian will take care to store the variable whichever you have created. You can keep easily in your mind the big Indian case the same way how we used to write it in, in notes. For an example, we generally used to write in the way 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The same way the data will get stored inside the big Indian machine. You can see this slide. I have just created this to understand more deeper. Here I have taken an integer 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and I want to store inside big Indian format. Then I will follow like in 0, 0, it will hold the MSB. Then it will follow the next byte orders. The little Indian case, the lower address will hold the LSB. Then again it will follow the again other subsequent orders. Compatibility issues in NDNS. Why the compatibility issue should be taken care when we are going to discuss or decide about the NDNS? You can consider you have a two machines. One is follows big Indian, another one is follows the little Indian. And whenever you want to transfer the data serially from big Indian to little Indian, in big Indian it will store the data in a different way, but the same data will be considered in a little Indian machine in a different way. For an example, in a big Indian, MSB will be considered, but in a little Indian, in the lower address, LSB will get stored. So finally, this will lead to errors in data processing. To avoid this compatibility problems, it is important to be aware of the NDNS of the system involved when transferring a data. As a programmer, you should first know about it in which machine you are working. For an example, whether you are using little Indian or big Indian. So how will you identify whether you are working now or whether you have a big Indian or little Indian machine? You can see this programming language, C programming language, it's easy to identify. For an example, here I have created the unseen integer, the variable name called data. So here it's a, it's a hexadecimal number and I'm just trying to store the first by one byte of data inside the character variable. If the particular variable holds a LSP, for an example 78, then it's a little Indian machine. If it is doesn't hold the 78 in this case, then it is a big Indian machine. Because you already know that if this is a little Indian machine, then the LSP will get stored first. So that is the reason we are using this program and identifying easily whether your machine is a big Indian or little Indian. And this program will be more useful when you are going to attend the interview. Interviewer might ask, can you write a simple C program to understand whether the particular machine is a big Indian or little Indian? So you can see this program and you can easily identify whether the particular machine is a big Indian or little Indian. Does NDNS matter for programmers? Because whenever you want to type a program, whether you have to care about NDNS? Yes, because NDNS can matter for program when they are working with the data that is stored in a file or in a network. So as we discussed, 
when you have a big indian and you want to transfer the data to little indian this will definitely create a problem whenever the data is getting processed as a programmer you what are the situations you have to consider for an example when reading or writing a data to a file or network stream then you have to care about the indianness when communicating with hardware devices and when working with binary data such as image or audio files and when working with programming languages that support multiple indianness such as java and c++ these all are the cases you have to care about the indianness and how indianness affect the code when you perform a bitwise operation on integer then compiler automatically handle the indianness and you no need to care about the indianness of the machine after the bitwise operation if the machine is little indian the lsp is stored at lower address either the lsp is stored at a higher address mainly indianness affect the result when you perform the type casting in your program suppose if you are creating a character array with two elements and when you are trying to do the type casting here i try to change it to short integer so in that case indianness will create a problem for an example when i try to print the value after doing the type conversion so finally i get it 0 1 that means i am using a little indian machine but if you are using a big indian machine then you will get a different result so whenever you are going to do the type casting then there you have to carefully handle the ndns and next thing is about like whenever you want to exchange the data between the different ND indian machines then you have to care more for an example the standard network order is big indian so we can call it as network order there is a lot of function which has used when we send the data to the network for an example h2o-n-s this is a function called like host to network short h2o-n-l host to network long n-t-o-h-s network to host short n-t-o-h-l network to host long the above mentioned functions that means these functions help to program in portability no matter if the program runs on a little indian or big indian machine they always work the way they should and very important point what you have to consider is there is no order matter for the single byte for deeply understand this concept we can take one example you you have a two machines mission one for an example mission one and mission two the so mission one is a big indian and mission two is a little indian so if you want to transfer the data like one two three four five six seven eight then how this will get transferred for an example mission one will get stored in a big indian so msp will get stored in the lower address then first it has to call the function htonl then this has written to the portable you can consider the number still represented in the same way however it has started meaning msb will get stored after calling this function as well and whenever the machine 2 receives the data then it will call ntohl and machine 2 gets the value represented in a reverse way because of from ntohtl function which then result to however you wanted so this is the way exchanging of data between different indian machines can happen by using all these functions then now might be you have a question which indianness is better so there is no meaning to say who is the better big indian or little indian it only arranges the data in a predefined order thanks for watching this video if you like it please share it with your friends if you want to stay with us for more technical content then please subscribe our channel Thank you so much. Have a nice day.